Developments in the last 15 minutes. A judge sentenced the killers who murdered a woman hiding in her closet while she was on the phone with 911. Channel 2's Tom Jones is live in downtown Atlanta where one of the defendants apologized to the family but insisted he's innocent. Tom. Hey, Fred. Uh, prosecutors asked the judge here to sentence all three men to life without parole for the murder of Pamela Williams, but only one got that sentence. Jonathan Banks just got sentenced to life without parole. His two co defendants, James Calhoun and James Sims, received life with parole. Let's go to some video shot in court uh, moments ago. The three broke into Camp Creek Target store manager Pamela Williams' home in November 2013 as she hid in her closet on the phone with 911 saying burglars were in her home. The attorneys for the men asked for life with parole, saying they were young and deserved a chance to re enter society. But Erica Williams said her sister told her sometimes you have to meet people where they are, and that's what she urged the judge to do with the three defendants. So, what I ask the court today is meet them where they are, meet them for the burglars that they chose to be and the murderers that they ultimately became, and sentence them to the longest sentence possible, life without parole. And once again, only one of the defendants, Jonathan Banks, received life without parole. Uh, James Sims and James Calhoun received life with parole. Before Banks was sentenced, he uh, told the court that he had remorse for the Williams family, but said he had zero to do with the murder. I'll be putting more of his testimony together, and you'll hear that beginning on Channel 2 Action News at 4. We're live in downtown Atlanta. Tom Jones, Channel 2 Action News.